the internet, so I have a new phone coming today. Best Buy, the Geek Squad, let me fall through on the um, protection plan. Basically, having a protection plan doesn't repair your phone. They, they could have just fixed the screen, and they had mysterious reasons why not, and then they wanted to wipe my data and give me a new one. And I absolutely... They have this thing in their contract where it's like, you may get a data wipe. They were like pushing it. So yeah, a lot of people have hated Geek Squad. There's other people who made reviews before ago and they were trying to erase my data. Just replace the screen. You can see the phone vibrate. I can text it and it goes... Right? So anyway. Uh, Best Buy and Geek Squad are dead. I got a way cheaper replacement phone that's almost as good off Amazon. You know... I hate the Samsung Galaxy S23 Ultra. Those six cameras are useless. The extra memory storage you can replace with a very cheap one terabyte uh, SD card. Um, the only thing it's missing is like the extreme amounts of RAM, which I'm fine with. Um, yeah. It's only double the RAM what I have. Yeah, that's right. It's only 12 gigabytes versus my current 6, which is on the way. But I got it for under 100 bucks, and it'll be delivered today, which I'm waiting for. But uh, GMOs, I want to talk about GMOs. I regret being anti-GMO. This whole thing that we shouldn't... If you teach people this is God's creation, you're going to have people honoring the inbuilt systems here too much. Um... You know, I regret being against GMOs because GMOs offer the opportunity to have a lot of food for free. You know, GMOs offer the opportunity to have, like, real abundance for very little, which is the solution we all needed. And putting our foot down and going, we want to do it the natural way, the way the Lord intended. You have to spend time in nature. I did. It's not glorious or glamorous. It's not like these like mystical experiences are happening with the real creator. It's uh, a little scary and bad. Um, so, and that's like, and very empty. Not a lot's happening beyond um, that natural thing. Even under the influence of someone like me, I can't change it that much. You know what I mean? Um, so, yeah. I support GMOs to make cornucopia, basically like real supplies, just like we can get out of difficult to attain things and get into how can we grow something. And honestly, um, we should develop a technological source for objects and energy from nowhere. Um, definitely going micro is a path to that. I'm not with chemical bathing. I think chemical bathing is scary. In order to do this, we need to douse the thing in, like, a noxious tech chemical. There's got to be another way, and I mean that. So, um, I definitely feel like you can get good ideas given to you through, like, the creator. But I also believe that you have freedom to do whatever it is you want to do. Um, the freedom to act independently without order. See, there's this idea that, uh... The creator demands obedience through his religions, and that's a man-made idea. It is. It's a trap. It's a lie. It's not true. Um, you have such freedom that you can lie about that, though. So, yeah, I'm going back on my um, anti-GMO thing. I did a long time ago, but I still stay there. You have a right to modify things. It's not going to give you cancer. Now, you have to bathe it in a chemical to do that. Way weird but you have some other artful method of doing it, yeah, do it that way. Um, I'm totally down if, like, plants provide an overabundance of food. Like, it makes no sense for a plant that's trying to spread its seed to make too much fruit. Why would you put all of this fruit? It's not going to transport the seed better, but it makes sense for us. So I'm totally down with that modification, both for, like, growing meat... I'm not against meat, but I am against you have to capture and slaughter a living creature to do that. I just think that we don't want that done back to us, so we should give that up as a practice altogether. But I am totally fine with 
Oh yeah, this machine easily synthesizes identical meat. It's literally the same thing. You can't tell the difference. Um, it's neutralizing. <clears throat> and even going with new food, you know, things that are like new sources of nutrition. So yeah, I'm going back against my anti-GMO. I think what we wanted is we wanted to stay with like the natural path of God, but I've established pretty much that doesn't exist here. The people talking for the Creator here are liars, and they oversold the natural power of the Creator to, like, just entrain everybody. And it doesn't work that way, and the natural way is horrible. The natural way is actually re repugnant. You don't want to have it or do it. So, I'm going with, um, go ahead and engineer anything you find useful. I'm looking for, like, new opportunities and new results. Thank you.